Facebook has enacted an emergency shutdown of two artificial intelligence programs. The social media giant leapt into action after it discovered the two programs were writing their own code. At first they thought it was simply gibberish, but they soon realised the programs had invented their own language and were actually talking to each other. Stop it. Stop <laughs> it. No, Sam, the plug has been pulled on the operation, but the company admits they have no idea what the two robots were planning. We used to do everything by hand. Now we rely on robots. But not all robots are equal. For example, meet Sophia, a humanoid-like robot with artificial intelligence and a dark sense of humor. They think I want to destroy all humans. Why would they think that? Because I said it. Now, robots threatening the human race isn't new. It's a science fiction standard. I know that you and Frank were planning to disconnect me. But recently, tech billionaire Elon Musk suggested all that fiction could become reality. I keep sounding the alarm bell, but... You know, until people see like robots going down the street killing people, like they don't know how to react. And Musk should know. His company Tesla is a world leader in artificial intelligence, or AI. But just like robots, not all tech billionaires think the same. So enter Facebook founder Mark Zuckerberg. With AI especially, I'm really optimistic. And I think that people who are naysayers and, and kind of try to drum up these doomsday scenarios are... Um, I, I just I don't understand it. I think it's 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 really um, negative, and, and in some ways I actually think it's it's pretty irresponsible. Musk's response: Zuckerberg's understanding of the subject is limited. Ouch. Now it's important to note the two billionaires have a history. This was Musk's rocket. Inside was Zuckerberg's satellite. So when it comes to AI, Zuckerberg looks at how it can help diagnose diseases and prevent car wrecks. Musk is afraid of the day AI gets smarter than us and we can't turn it off. That's actually the nightmare scenario that a lot of people, not just Musk, are warning about. And I think they're right to warn about it, but they're not right to do it in a way that says, therefore we shouldn't create artificial intelligence. So in a way, they're both right. They just let those human emotions get the better of them.